Hey Bianca Land, it's Dimitri and today I'm going to discuss the beekeeping journey that I'm getting ready to start here. So for many of you that know who follow me on Instagram or Facebook or my other YouTube channels or any sort of social media, um, Bianca Land is getting ready to get two beehives and we're going to start around April 21st when I actually pick up the bees. So this is kind of an introduction video. So the first question I'd like to answer is why am I beekeeping? Um, the main reason is I really like bees. Um, even as a kid, I've always had this weird kind of habit of like touching honeybees. Um, I like the fact that they're docile. I find them very interesting in the fact that they have giant colonies and they all work together more or less for the greater good of the colony. Uh, something very different and unique. And I'd like to point out too that I'm not interested in more or less the honey or honey production. Yes, it's a cool benefit of having honeybees but I'm not going into this as like a money-making venture. I'm not going into this as a way to like make honey for myself. But anyways, I'm really just doing this because I enjoy honeybees and I'm looking for a fun hobby to start. So the second question I'd like to answer is why am I making these videos? So the reason I'm making these videos is I'd like to show that you don't have to be the stereotypical beekeeper. So for those of you that don't know, typically those in beekeeping are older and they're a little more, I guess, unpolished and so I want to show that basically anybody can do beekeeping if you really want to do it and it's kind of a fun and interesting hobby to pick up. I also want to make these videos short and concise because I see a lot of beekeeping videos online. There are definitely some really good ones but a lot of them are like 10-20 minutes on like a very short topic that should have been answered quickly and it wasn't. And so I want to make these videos concise, easy, and hopefully you can learn from my mistakes and kind of my process as I go along. So third is my beekeeping technique that I'm going to be following. Uh, more or less, I'll be following Michael Bush. He has this book on beekeeping naturally. Um, I'm not like a big health nut or anything. I'm not into organics. I'm not against GMOs. Um, anyways, but I am. I don't really want to add chemicals, whether they be organic or, I guess, harmful chemicals to my bees. Um, for a couple of reasons. A, I don't think it's beneficial to the bees. I want them to grow up as naturally and wild as possible. And C, I don't want to spend a lot of my time and money kind of tinkering with the bees. I want them to be, again, natural. So that's kind of my goal of doing this kind of Michael Bush kind of theory of how he does beekeeping is more or less to limit the amount of work I have to do. But the thing is, is we'll see. I haven't done beekeeping. I'm brand new. So we're going to see. Maybe this will be a great idea. Maybe I'll love Michael Bush's methods or maybe I'll be frustrated and end up trying other methods as we go. But anyways, we'll kind of see as we go, and I'm more open to changing my mind as I learn more about beekeeping. And the fourth point I'd like to make is that beekeeping is very controversial. Um, there are all kinds of people that are for and against like every different aspect of beekeeping. Um, again, I hope you guys don't put ridiculous comments on my videos, but again, I guess it does help my kind of YouTube channel. But that being said, I'm not here to tell you how to do beekeeping. I'm just here to show you more or less my experience, what I am doing, and you can either learn from it. Um, you can see that beekeeping isn't that hard and that average people can do it. You don't have to be a specific type of person or fit some stereotype. And it's kind of a fun and I guess rewarding hobby as you get going. So in conclusion, I hope you guys enjoy the journey. Um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe below if you want more content like this. Uh, Bianca Land in general is going to cover more or less my property and what we're working on, anything from building fences to my beekeeping to gardening. So if you like it, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And as always, until next time. Thanks for watching Bianca Land. If you like my videos, don't forget to share, like, and subscribe so I can continue to make more content like this.